I was awake way, 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 way too early this morning. <laughs> 3.30. That's not a time for be awake for a normal person. <laughs> okay, so welcome back to 15 blades, 15 shapes. I have something new to show you. This is a Parker, my, this is my first Parker product, really. And I love the box. Love the packaging very nicely. Look at that. This is a Parker Silver Tip Travel Brush. And I got this because this was my uh, previous travel brush. This is a Simpson, very nice Simpson uh, tube and a MAGA Racer, it's a synthetic knot, which is nice, but it's a little bit stiff. And uh, it's hard to face lather it with it. So uh, I wanted a, a badger um, brush for my, for my trip. And uh, looking at it now, if you can see, this brush kind of matches with this tube better. So what I'm going to do is going to use this brush in this tube and this brush which is all black with a um, tuxedo black synthetic knot with a black handle. I'm going to use on the black so this is, will be my my Darth Vader brush. Anyway, let's start with the shave. So it was nice because uh, a couple days ago I was watching a video on MACTIV 59 uh, channel about, oops, about uh, brushes and how to make a good lather, how to put the, the right amount of water in a brush. To make it loud and he mentions that uh, synthetics and badger don't need too much uh, hydration so that means I can put it in the in the locomotive I love this cup and right now it starts my shave so let's do that and for today, we have a new blade, of course, and we're going to use the Merker. Merker made in Germany. My first German blade. Let's see how it goes, but actually this is how it performs. Because you, for those of you that don't want to watch the entire video, this is the, basically the, the specs of the blade. So let's begin. So Mark from Mantic 59 was mentioning that in order to have the right amount of water, you shouldn't flick the brush because the flicking motion removes the water from the center of the brush, which is where most of the uh, lather creation happens so instead of flicking the idea is to squeeze the brush a little bit just like this for example I'm going to just squeeze it a tiny bit and that's it so let's begin loading the brush And he also mentions that while it might appear that 
too bubbly at first, you keep working on it and it will eventually get to the right uh, consistency. And it's making a lot of leather now. This is a very soft brush, very soft. Lather is flying all over the place. Wow. I wasn't using enough water before. Thank you, Mark. <laughs> okay, and for fr my friend Fernando, who from Panama, he mentioned that I wanted to know how do they move to remove the soap from my lips. What I do is just simply do like this. I hope you see it. Just uh, like licking my finger with my lips. That's what I do. Lick my finger with my lips and that's it. Okay. So let's start with the Mercure blade setting seven on this lens. efficient but not very sharp But it's working. So see, since I don't, I have enough water on the brush. I don't need to wet my face for the second pass. You just need to paint the fence, as they say. Great brush, wow, great purchase. I'm gonna put the link on the brush in the description. Awesome brush. See? That's it. Okay, setting nine on the Mercure. Second pass.
color is sufficient. Touching. Not as comfortable as an Astra or the Boss Hot. Was pretty efficient. So I can make it into the into the uh, rotation. Although maybe I wouldn't because I haven't checked the price. But I don't want to have too many blades, too many different blades for my rotation. Blades, maybe three, or more than that, for this for day-to-day -day shading. Mm -hmm. Maybe the boss hot for the days that have less less growth, and the Astra for those days that they have more beer than other days. I don't know, or maybe the other way around. Great brush, great little brush, very, very soft, awesome leather, very nice, great purchase for my trip, right on time. So it seems I'm going to work now, all spice. Love flow. 
boss by smell. Great. Bring back memories. Okay, gents, thanks again for my for being with me on another of my shaves. We're coming close to the to finishing the series, and uh, I can't remember which one is next in line, but at seven o'clock. I think the next one is uh, a, a couple seven o'clock Gillettes. It's gonna be fun. Okay, thanks again for your subscriptions and for your comments, and see you in the next video.